the season of Survivor was so different because the three tribes and being a returning player, I didn't have that bullseye on my back before. I could just kind of happy-go-lucky go through the game. And I never got to the real strategic part of the game where the merge happens. I think in the first couple hours of the merge, games are made and broken right in that first couple hours. Uh, being able to experience the whole gambit. When Mark Burnett envisioned the show, he envisioned you know individual immunities, which I finally got to experience, and, and final tribal, which I got to experience. And I think the only part of the game that I never got to experience was Ponderosa, thank God, when you watch those videos. So I can't say that I could have yanked any more out of this game than I did. I don't think I had anything to prove, and I think I was okay with the fact that I didn't it took me so long to get back in the game. And once I stepped back on that beach, I was like, wow, I had underestimated how badly I wanted to play this game again. As torturous as it is to play this game physically and emotionally, to watch a season and know that you could be on it and have said no would be more torture than actually playing again. There was a big part of me that wanted to go against the best of the best. I mean, Malcolm and I had gone, we both won three individual challenges. Uh, we had an alliance from a, for a long time and I, I wanted to keep that. I wanted to win valiantly and you know, Lisa talked some sense into my head and it turned out that it didn't matter either way. But if our plan had worked about getting rid of Malcolm and Denise way earlier into that, it would have been a lot better as it turns out. Denise is a very deserving winner in a lot of respects. Lisa would have been a deserving player in a lot of respects. I was a deserving player in a lot of respects. At that moment in time that those votes were cast, you could have voted an hour later and it could have been different. But ironically, she was the one that I was the least worried about. When I was counting votes and jury votes and who I wanted to sit next to me, I wanted to bring Denise to the end because as I watched her game and I watched how other people talked about her game, I thought, that's a person that I could win against the best. But it turned out that she was the least offensive and didn't make any enemies along the way. And I believe that's the reason she won. And the right person won because the game doesn't lie. It speaks for itself. Um, I'd love to go back against her because I can beat her. <laughs>